Hello, hello, hello. This is Tom from Tom and Ruth Philippine Adventures. Uh, today, guess what day it is? It's a uh, solar day here in the Philippines. We are actually installing another 400 watts. I don't know if you can see them in the background. I'll see if I can zoom in. Nope. I probably can. Anyway, he's up on the roof over there. You can see him. He's actually uh, putting that into 400 watts. We're actually going to take the grid tie inverter off the system, uh, or we could put on all 1,200. The grid tie was working fine, but the problem I noticed that it, what it was doing, it was not, it was not putting in true. Uh, we had 400 watt on it, and it only tapped in about 100 at a time. So we're kind of doing a test. We need to rewire it back. We will. So we're going to have 1,200 watts here. If not, we'll put 1,200 watts on the grid tie. But I think this would be the benefit because I'll get the most, best of both worlds. Brownouts, no worries. Uh, uh, all I need to do is add to the battery pack. And that's not a problem. Still working on that. But I thought maybe you'd like to see that. So he's up there doing it now. He's been busy. He had uh, delivers. He's doing a lot of street lights. Here in the Philippines, they're doing a lot of street light. Uh, actually uh, installs on solar which is excellent, excellent. You have the solar, and all you got to do is add a battery to it, let it last all night. And uh, those are motion censored also. They got some that stay stationary, but uh, I think it's uh, really something that's really good. So I hope you enjoy the video. It's coming up. There you go. Thank you for watching. Please hit subscribe. Okay, as you can see, I got my solar set up. This is uh, an update on the solar system. We have 1,200 watts running into the house now, and I have my house on my solar. Uh, as you can see, it's 13.3 uh, volts. Actually, that's off about two. It's actually running 13.5. Uh, this is the grid tie-in inverter here, which you see we actually took this offline. 
and what we're doing now we're running 100 percent solar here so right now it's producing right now uh the amps to see here the watts it's, it's going to be hard for you to see we're looking at uh, 40 watts it's running what's running now is lights a tv satellite a uh, little fridge it runs about 75 80 watts 100 watts at a time and then of course batteries now the battery is still the same batteries i've not added more batteries yet i will just haven't uh, found the right ones yet see the wireless controller it's actually talking to the phone let me know give me upgrades and alert if the system gets low battery gets low and it's just a wireless setup is attached and as you see here it's kind of hard to see but the temperature temperature gauge on the batteries so it gives the temperature of the batteries actually that should go down in the batteries itself so give me the correct temperature so this uh, pure sine wave inverter we're on a 218 219 uh, volts 13.3 uh, amps on the batteries and it's actually 13.6 it's set at 13.7 as the alarm but I want to show you this we're running everything on the, on everything in the house I'm going to show you now aircon all right I have the aircon running on it this is a 960 watt unit it's a split aircon type matrix um, it's got a little uh, one horse motor believe it or not it's running on this um, of course it's uh I don't have enough power on the batteries but I have enough power during the day for the 10 12 hours to run this so as you can see I'll show you how it's run so uh, for right now see have a have, I have it plugged in here there's the wire I plugged in here and you follow it all the way to the solar panel I have the um, I have the set up that way right now we haven't run the wires yet we will run the wires so there you go we're running air con on the solar nice nice so brownouts okay okay uh, as long as it's daytime anywhere from 6 a.m. until 4 45 p.m. we're set anything after that then we just run batteries in the fan and everything is fine till I get my battery built up to the one to two kilowatts he's making me battery packs now so he's going to make me battery packs for it. So I thought you guys like to see this. Thank you for watching. And please subscribe.